Hey Hackintosh gang, welcome back to my channel. Today you will learn how to validate your config.plist using OpenCore Configurator. I will be using this NEC Versa Pro VGS with Broadwell processor, 5th generation. A big shout out by the way to Alex for successfully installing the Mac OS Catalina on his Samsung AT Book 4. Comment down below if my videos helped you with the Hackintosh installation on your machine. Using OpenCore Configurator, let's mount the config.p list of your Hackintosh. Go to Tools, then Config Checker. This small window will pop up. On the CPU family, select your proper CPU codename. It has desktop and laptop section for the Intel-based processor. I will select the Broadwell CPU on the laptop section. As of this recording, we have 0.98 version of OpenCore. Leave the other settings as shown. Make sure you are connected on the internet. This will download the database. Wait for this part to be ready. Then click the check button. Now this small window will appear. Let me just move these windows side by side. On the left of Open Core Configurator, these are the main section of config.plist, and inside it are the subsettings of those section. We can validate the config.plist of your Hackintosh by comparing the values in every section. I mark the subsections that you can refer where they are located. We will pay attention closely to the one with yellow question mark. This means that we will adjust that settings on our config.plist. For example, Rebase Regions is equal to yes. This means that our config for Rebase Regions is enabled or set to true. The next line, but should normally be no. This means that we have to make it to false or disabled. All you have to do is to uncheck it to make it to no or disabled. The first yellow question mark here, I will just ignore it. It's just a warning. I will go all through the yellow question marks and adjust my configuration.
On this part, the legacy enabled is missing. I will just ignore it and move along to the next one. Carefully look through the every subsettings, it may be hard to find it on your first attempt. For this open canopy portion, I will just ignore it and carry on to the next. For this output portion, you need to have 16 settings. I will just ignore it and carry on to the next. Press delete on your keyboard to remove this max text. Now we are all done. Close the config checker window and let's save the configuration. This is now clean and no issues. You may now restart your Hackintosh. That's about it for this tutorial. You may be interested on the next topic on your screen. Click it and see you there.